test, test. Alright, what is up my African American community? Uh, I, never mind. Uh, well, some of you have requested that there be a video on 3D editing. And, uh, I guess Adobe After Effects. And what we will be creating is this little piece right here. Yeah. Cool as shit. Boom. Alright. So, what you need to do is you need to have Adobe After Effects. I'm not giving you a link because I got mine two years ago and I don't know where. Technically, I bought it legally. That's what I like to tell the, the feds. Well, um, anyway, if I didn't tell you already, I'm Naruto Nick. If you already cannot tell by my sexy ass voice. Alright, let's begin. Alright, so first of all, you need to, if you wanted to create this, you need to just get a bunch of images and just throw them down and reorganize them like so. See? It's just random ass images placed by me. Alright. After you do that, you can add some motion to them. I don't know. This is what I do. I add a little motion to them so they poke and everything. And you can do that by going in there and adjusting the position. Uh, the z-axis of the position. But before you do that, you're going to check all of these boxes so you can edit the z-axis. Checking this is making your object a 3D object and therefore um, you can edit your z-axis uh, next check all these boxes this is motion blur this is what makes everything look smooth and awesome alright next step go to layer new camera um, I'll be honest I don't know what the hell these are yeah they're different types of millimeters of film or cameras, but to be quite honest, I've never noticed the difference. So push OK. I push cancel because I already have one, but push OK, and you will have your camera right here. Go down to your transform, check all of these. I check all of them, you're not using all of them. Go start here. Let me turn this back on. Start here, and go to your orientation and just like okay fuck and have it at like I don't know 316 that'll basically cut it out of the frame just make sure you just zoom the orientation until it's out of the frame and then uh Go about five frames till it's in a little bit. Go two frames and make sure it's almost all the way in. And then go about a second and make make it a little out. Actually, not those exact times for the second because uh, you might want to make this longer. But these first couple times you need like this because it's it flows a lot smoothly. And then when you have your final point set up, all three of these, select them and push push F9. And you'll get these little hourglass looking things. What that does is it smooths out. It's basically yeah, it's a smooth. So it it stops at a different time. Um Yeah. Uh I hope this tutorial helps. If it was not informational enough please take your dick out and slap yourself with it because it was. Alright, thank you.